Come on, let's go. Load up. What up, YouTube? We are gator hunting again. Real Babes still has her tag to fill. And we got a little bit of wind today. It's gonna die down later on. We've got some islands we're gonna go hunt behind. But right now, we're checking out one of our neighborhood coves because there's usually some pretty good gators in here. I'm not superstitious very much, but we're gonna partake in a little gator hunting ritual. Real Babes hates it. I'm not down with that project, it's yummy. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna show you all how we do this. You bite the tip off. Mm. Laura, will you help me with the cheese? Real Babes is going to assist with the cheese insertion. Oh yeah, give me a lot. Oh yeah, okay. Mm. <laughs> and there it is. Mm. I got some for Mr. Wiggles. Delicious. <laughs> oh, that's <a> <laughs> Even Wiggles is participating in our ritual. I'll eat a pepperoncini just not with the easy cheese. That stuff's sketchy to me. <laughs> it's cheese in a can. Yeah, um, it sounds sketchy to well, me. Cheers, everybody. I like the Italian ones. I think I found me a new snack. <laughs> they were out of regular pepperoncinis, so we got some special Italian blend. They're pretty tasty. Oh, I'll oh, definitely have one. We're gonna get out of the shallow water. We're gonna run over to a couple of islands, and we've seen some big gators back there, so hopefully they're there today. That's a special one. Do it. Take one for the team. No, I'm not eating that. We're not going to kill a gator if you don't eat it. Stop. <laughs> don't <put this> <laughs> I have to eat it now. <laughs> we saw a bunch of big gators last time we were in this spot. We've got a little bit of wind that's creating some ripples. But other than that, we're passing over a sand bottom right now. The water's super clear. which means if we chase one down, we're gonna be able to find him, spot him at least, which is gonna make hunting a lot easier. We haven't seen a single gator yet today. And that's because real babes did not participate in the popper ritual. gonna check out this area. We didn't plan on hunting it, but we're gonna check it out while we're here. How big is he looking? I can see him without binoculars. Okay, you want to get some rods ready? Yeah. That is a big one. <laughs> okay, we've got our eyes on the biggest gator we have seen this season. Wiggles, go load up. Get him up and he's down. Okay. Uh, this gator went down. We're gonna chill for a minute, see if he pops back up. And while we're waiting, I wanted to show y'all something. That is the rediversion canal. And what the rediversion canal does is it rediverts water from Lake Moultrie into the Santee River. The Santee Cooper Lake system is composed of Lake Marion and Lake Moultrie. And those were created when they dammed the Cooper River and the Santee River. And now all the water flows from Marion into Moultrie and then out the locks or the turbine at uh, Panopolis into the Cooper River. And what this does is it re-diverts water from Lake Moultrie over into the Santee River system. He might come back up. Yeah, 
If any of y'all watch our channel, this is the Rediversion Canal, and that's where we've done some of our shad fishing and some of the shad fishing videos. We fish for shad when they run, which is generally in the fall, and it's a good time. This is a pretty good sized gator. So we're gonna invest a little bit of time just sticking around to see if this guy pops back up. That is all coal and it is headed to the power plant. Hey baby. Yeah. Are you regretting not eating the peppercini? No. Why are you cursing us, man? I'm not, you You're cursed Christmas. us. You're making this like You're the one that refused to eat it. Now I have to eat a stupid pepperoni filled with cheese. Yeah, you do. Like humidity around here. We are in the same spot we were night before last when we saw the other two big gators, but we're seeing nothing yet. And I seriously, I'm not really superstitious, but I think it's because Laura did not eat. The pepperoni. Oh my god, give me a pepperoni. Just get a little tiny bit of cheese. You don't have to do it. You don't have to stuff it. Because if I don't eat the pepperoni and we don't harvest it, it's going to be all your fault. It's going to be my fault. It is. It's 100%. You made that up. Mm -hmm. I didn't make it you up. You totally made that up. I did not make it up. You made it up to make me eat this a pepperoni is, with cheese in it. Call it superstition, call it whatever you want, but it, it's, it's a proven method. <laughs> 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 Oh, I can smell them from here. They're good. I won't fill it up, but... All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah. Mm. Now we're going to start seeing gators. <laughs> she fucking hates it. It's I not like, bad. It's, it's not as bad as I thought it would be, but... Yeah. No, they're pretty tasty. It's like pickles and peanut butter. I mean, yes, I like pickles. Yes, I like peanut butter. Put them together? Put them no. Together, yeah. Oh, that's, pass, that's a pass. boat popper, babe. Those things are awesome. <laughs> This is the bottom of what we're going over right now. It's hard packed sand. And we are in a little cypress bay that is full of stumps, like that guy right there. And we're just being careful and hopefully we see one of those gators. Mm -hmm. Something comes out, there's a pit. Oh yeah, look at him. Little guy. Little cute one. Uh -huh. About three foot. About three foot? Okay. Yeah. I missed it. Lane caught it. <laughs> oh, I see that stump. Right oh, yeah. after Rio Babes ate the pepperoni, <laughs> like less than a minute, what yeah. did we see? We saw a gator. I'm telling you. <laughs> it works. I don't know what it is. It works. Oh, right there. I think he just wants up on the seat. We are in the bay that all the big gators we hustled up the other night basically fled into. This is right where we saw those big ones. Right around the bend here. Real babes just spotted some kayaks that looks like they washed up into this cypress grove during one of the storms. So we're taking the boat where we shouldn't be taking the boat because we're gonna try to retrieve them, maybe even salvage them. Oh, thank you, baby. That might be Mary's missing kayak. Our neighbor lost a kayak and hopefully this is hers. <laughs> what was it? It wasn't a kayak. No, it wasn't a kayak. It was a giant inflatable something that washed up. Okay. Inflatable <laughs> float thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We spotted one that was about six, and Real Babes still wants a bigger one. Eight foot plus, baby. That's respectable. Yeah. <laughs> At like 11 o'clock. Yep. In between that and the tree next to it, to the right of it. Oh, wait, where'd he go? Oh, yeah, yeah, he's still behind it, to the right. And he's moving to the left. Oh, yeah, I see him. Okay, you want me to get us all on it? Yeah. Oh, 
Yeah. Mm. One's heading to the right. Yeah. We've got a couple of gators up here. One of them's actually hunting a duck. I'm going to turn the camera around, but they're too far off. You're not going to be able to see them. There. Looks like he's heading towards that marker. I bet he's, he's either hunkered down right here or he got back up into the jungle. I see him. That looks like a big one heading straight down the canal. I can see the V, the wake that he's leaving right now. Real Babes ate the pepperoncini. We started seeing gators, but we haven't picked out an animal to really target yet. It's snack time. Yeah. Mr. Wiggles wants to partake in snack time. Sure. I love all the birds squawking and chattering when they're getting in bed. It just makes it feel like a jungle. The area of the lake that we were hunting in that day is really, really, really shallow swamp. And it's hard to access without a mud boat or an air boat. And we're able to access this spot because what looks like a canal in the video right here is not. It's an old logging road. And they actually had to cut down through all the mud and the muck to reach hard pack that would support the weight of the logs that they were moving out. And they logged Lake Moultrie before they flooded it. Lake Marion, they weren't able to completely log the lake out before they had to finish up the dam project because of World War II. And it created an urgency to finish up the dam and get that hydroelectric power going to help with the war effort. And that's what it looks like. It's about six foot deep in the center and a foot outside. We have now seen the biggest gator. This joker is at least 12. You can see him on the GoPro. That guy is at least 12 foot, at least. That is a monster. Get ready, Wiggles heel back here. Heel, load up. That is That guy's huge. He's going down. Cast, cast. You stay in the dog seat while we hunt the skater, buddy. It's getting close to dark and we are gonna switch up tactics. And right now we are gonna put in to this little beach so Mr. Wiggles can go potty. Here we go, let's go potty. There's a boy. Watch out for gators, buddy. <laughs> okay, bud. You gotta come load up now. We have got an absolute gorgeous sunset and two pretty big gators. There's one. There's the other one. I think this is the big one we hustled up earlier. He looks like he knows what's up. He turned away from us. Actually, he turned back to the left. I can see his nose now. He's getting ready to go down. See how his head raised up a little? Okay, I'm gonna get ready to take a cast in a minute, I think. He knows we're chasing him. Yeah, he's a big animal. He didn't get that big by being stupid. Uh-uh. I don't think he's gonna want to keep looking at. Um, he's huge. Let's go see if we can't get that one up there. 
We are chasing another alligator. I'm gonna blow this up so hopefully y'all can see it. He is right there. Oh, that guy's big. He's a lot bigger than eight. Yeah, that's a real good gator. And he's letting us get real fucking close. He's getting ready to sink. You can get him, get him. Oh, oh God. Oh, oh. You have him? Oh, I see him. Okay. We gave it a minute. This joker popped back up. Lane dropped the hook literally right on his nose. I'm going to try to blow it up in the video, see if we can actually see the contact. He made a big splash, dove, turned, and we did a couple of blind casts, and then he popped back up. And he's letting us chase him. He's letting us get really, really close. For a gator this size, I don't know where he came from because he's not very smart. Yeah, he's like zigzagging. Hold on, don't, don't reel, don't reel, dude. You got it free? Yeah. Cool. Okay, we're gonna chill and wait for one of these guys to pop back up, hopefully. We got some folks out here camping on Coon Island. I don't know if they're gator hunting or just camping out. It's a pretty popular camping island and this time of year, the weather is phenomenal. You can leave it right on him. We've got the first gator of tonight, and he's looking right at us. There's a big space between his eyes. So it's a big gator, and we think it's the gator we hustled up from out in the open water. I'm just gonna keep creeping the way we are. Get those rods ready though, y'all. He is still there. Yeah, that's a big animal. I mean, y'all can just about touch him. There, I get him. Okay, y'all can sort of see me, but I don't want to turn the flash on or the light source because that gator popped back up not too far from where we were casting on him. And we're pulling up on him right now. Trying to, I hope y'all can see him. We decided to roll home and recharge. We're gonna get some coffee, cook up those steaks, eat, and then get back out on the water. We are grabbing coffee to get caffeinated, and then we are gonna go do some more gator hunting. Real Babes has even got all kinds of fancy winter clothes type things on. It's only I'm 67 ready for degrees two. outside. Exactly, man, it's 67 <laughs> degrees out here. I gotta bundle up. Is it 67? Yeah. Oh wow, it is cold. Okay, we got caffeinated. We got fed, we took a little rest, and now we're going to get more gators. Those lights are the people that are camping on the island, and that's where we're headed to. I didn't even see where y'all landed. That is 
is a friggin' ginormous bass. Real Babes and I are heading into town to get something to eat, and I'm buying a little something. And here's her little switchblade, which I think is so cute. It's in her colors and whatnot. So, um, figured I'd show that to y'all. But notice after dinner last night, there was no gator footage. That's because we went back out, we chased a bunch of gators. They were pretty much on to our game at that point in the night. And you really can't see a lot other than just shining lights. So I didn't film much. Real Babes casting has improved considerably. I'm trying. And I don't know if we're gonna go, we're not hunting tonight, but we're gonna take a little bit of a break. And I don't know what we're doing tomorrow. We might go dove hunting tomorrow. And we usually don't go to the dove field on Saturdays because it's busy. Public dove fields are almost weekends only exclusively. This is a private dove field. We can go pretty much whenever we want. Saturdays tend to be a little busier. But we have been wanting to get up to that part of the state because we want to spend a day checking out some sites and we want to go to the zoo. We want to go to the zoo in Columbia. So being Saturday, the zoo is going to be busy and the dove field is probably going to be busy. But we might head up there. If not, we got to cook up something else to do. And if y'all want to see what I'm buying in town, it's a really, really cool new toy. You're going to have to check out the next video. We're going to wrap this video up. Love y'all. Hope you have great plans coming for the weekend. Get out. Do something. Do anything. Enjoy yourself. And we will talk to y'all soon.